Hello, I thought I'd make a quick vlog again. Uh, I know I just posted one and I'm going to post this one. And this one is just to say, just to tell you a little bit more about what I have dealt with and what I deal with on a regular basis here in Cleveland. And so first, I'm just going to say that... Uh, the city itself is a tremendous city. It's wonderful and it has many, many great amenities for people. And it live it's a great city to live in. It's very uh resident friendly. I don't know the terminology, but it's very friendly for people who live here. It's it's convenient. And so I just wanted to say that because I'm not putting the city itself down. But what I am saying, and I'm not putting anyone down, I'm just saying that the things, I'm just reporting on the things that I see and the things that happen to me here in the city. So the first thing is, uh, well, I'm just going to mention a couple things that have, that have, that are recent. So... They let me know the other day, someone let me know the other day that I was too dumb for New York and too ugly for L.A. And this is the kind of stuff they do, and yet they attack everyone, especially me, for my thoughts, actions, deeds, but they attack me. And I'm the bad guy, right? I'm the bad guy. And they also, uh, I guess, you know... They just make a huge deal out of every little thing I do. So who am I? Hmm? I'll come back to this. I'm someone who is supposed to change the world for the better. And this is a plan, and I have a plan now to do just that. I am fulfilling my mission here on earth. And, and I have so many people who have been following me around for years and years and years now, disparaging my every move, my every thought, my every action, and making a huge deal out of every single little thing I've ever done. And every single little thing I may think or every single, my opinion, everything. So, and I can't even, I can't even, uh, I can't even let someone talk because if someone talks and I don't speak up, then obviously I agree with them. So um, these are just little things that keep happening. And there's something going on with the Hispanic community here. Well, maybe all over the world. I don't know that now I'm very hated by the Hispanic community. And then I'm very hated by a lot of different communities for something I said, did, thought, or something many, many years ago. So, now, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I just had to take care of a few things. So, now, uh, I am, I mean, I just, and this is why, because I'm not going to go into why I'm not going to take that job. I will not take that job because I don't want the same things to happen to me again, where everyone knows every single detail about my life and knows every single thing I do at home, everything, and and uh and gets angry if I even 
look at their look at them wrong or look at their outfits, you know. So <clears throat> I'm not taking a job. I'm not. I'm not going to. I'm not going to put myself through that ever again. Ever again. I'm going to trust Jesus. That's all I'm going to do is I'm just going to trust Jesus. Because I don't think anyone deserves that. To have an entire city angry because of something I think. You know, an entire community angry because of something I may have said 50 million years ago and thought a long time ago. You know, so, you know what? And if I don't speak up, I agree with it? No, I don't think so. That's not how it works. At least not for me. And I don't care. I don't care. I trust Jesus. I trust Jesus on everything. So... But, and so that's one thing. And I also wanted to mention that they have cameras all over my house. And, you know, my coworkers got to see me take a shower. And that's documented. That's on record. How? I mean, I just, these are things that I have to deal with on a regular basis. And I don't want to deal with people who are upset because I thought something wrong about their outfit or I thought something wrong about someone or whatever. I don't want to have to deal with that. I have to deal with people invading my privacy on a continual basis and everyone knowing what I think. So don't bring me your attitudes. Don't think I'm going to feel bad because I don't. I don't. Who do I think I am? I think I'm someone who deserves a little more respect than what you have given me. That's it. I don't think I'm anyone special. I just think I need common decency. And that's it. And on that note, I am going to end this vlog. And I'm going to say I hope everybody watching has a great evening tonight and a great day tomorrow and things go your way. All right. Bye.